everyone. This is Tanya from T and E Adventures. Hi, this is Ella. Girl, you are so beautiful. I am so happy to make this video and talk to you a little bit about the self-care challenge that Ella and I have started. This is my yoga space slash meditation room slash now with this COVID reality, it's become also my office. So this is definitely the space that I spend the most time in all throughout the day. So this video is all about self-care. I am a huge fan of Yoga with Adrienne. I love her yoga videos on YouTube and I was super excited when she announced that she was making a 30-day challenge called Breath. And as I was talking to Ella a little bit about it, um, I shared with her how I really wanted to do this 30-day challenge and she obviously expressed interest in doing this and I'm super happy because it's a wonderful way to hold each other accountable. So this is day one. I just watched the intro video of Yoga with Adrienne and she asked two very important questions. So I thought I would share it with you and share my answers. So Adrienne asked, why are you here and what do you think pulled you here? I think the reason why I am here and I want to do this 30 day challenge and what led me to and pulled me to this um, video, this 30 day challenge is because I find that it's hard for me to hold myself accountable with my yoga practice. I love yoga, but I'm not very consistent with my practice. So I don't consciously practice yoga every day. I do journal every day. I do take a few moments of my day to meditate and read, but I don't incorporate that physical part that should be intertwined with the mental aspect that I do, which is the journaling in my case. So that is what I think led me and inspired me when I saw that Adrienne was once again building a 30 day challenge for her viewers. And I hope that in this process, I really grow as a person. I become more in tune with my body, with my physical health. Spirituality is in line with also taking care of your body and with physical activity with what you eat um, with what you think so yeah this is what I hope for this 30-day challenge I um, am excited to take you guys on this journey and I'm very curious to see what Ella um, what inspired her to do this 30-day challenge and I wonder if our messaging is going to be the same if we're looking for the same things um, but what's beautiful about it is that we're doing it together but separate at the same time and it's going to be I think a, an interesting journey for each other to dive deeper into our souls. I am doing my day number two yoga challenge. Say hi, Diego. Hello. Yay, day three. Wait a second, day four. Hi guys, this is Ella. So I'm so excited to film our video today. Uh, why am I doing this this way? Am I by myself? No, look who's here. Hello. Yeah. Ella's in my yoga room. <laughs> yep. Well, so the lockdown uh, has like lived, so. Yep we decided to like do yoga together. I know like doing by ourselves is kind of boring. We want to accompany each other. <laughs> oh yeah, to be upfront and transparent with you guys, we tried this 30 day yoga challenge by ourselves and it was hard. Like we only <laughs> reached till day four and finally we decided, you know what, let's get together and let's do it together. And you'll see in the video, uh, we actually had a lot of fun doing this. <laughs> yeah, it's so fun and uh, we'll talk a little bit more about this video when we finish. But let's jump right in. Yeah. Yeah. Three, 
two, one. Let's go. I did at home too, but like this is different. Yeah, you know what? Like it's funny because you were saying how when Zena was breathing, yes, it relaxes you, and it's so true. Yeah. I think that's why like pet therapy is a thing because you don't um, realize how calm and like look at this one. She's super happy, and it just <laughs> makes the experience so much more different. Sometimes annoying, yeah. but different. <laughs> yeah. Well, we definitely like recommend all of you. Go ahead, try to do some yoga. Yes. And meditate. Like, you don't have to do every uh, movement like perfectly. It's it's the time that you actually spend to exactly. focus on doing this thing that will bring you the joy. That will actually um, give you a fresh start every morning. Yeah. yeah. It's different when you do it by yourself, yeah. and it's different when you do it with a friend. Like, I found that I laughed throughout the practice more, <laughs> and it's better that way because laughter is medicine i mean it depends on the individual some people like it by themselves but i actually kind of enjoyed it with a friend yeah me too yeah it was like, different like i like yeah. both like when by myself i can write my thoughts up after and mm -hmm. really be have the introspective journey mm -hmm. but when with you it was just I don't know, like, it just, it didn't feel it's boring. Like, <laughs> it, it's, uh, it, it's not just like a therapy or like a yoga doing, it, it's like spending time with friends, like also valuable, uh, exactly. what's that word, valuable time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. valuable, that's yeah. true. I think because our theme this month has been love and like, you know, love yourself and mm -hmm. it's important to also find a way to love yourself with your mental health with taking a pause and realizing, okay, I just need a little 20 minutes to charge my batteries. Whether you do it yourself with a friend, whether it's yoga, whether it's meditation, whether it's exercise, whatever. Sometimes you need to be a little selfish to mm -hmm. really incorporate that self-love and that moment where you can be present. And yeah. sometimes, you know, we forget. Like, you know, we were complaining about how busy our day were. And then now here we are and I feel reinvigorated. I feel like I can take on all the extra work, pile it on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. And by breathing, just, just let it breathing. out. Breathing. Yeah. Yeah. Like what she said, um, your breath is your anchor. Exactly. 
Yes. Let the negative out. Negativity out. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's the only way to let the positivity flow in your heart is by breathing out the negativity. Exhaling yep. it. It's yep. Exhaling it? Exhaling it. <laughs> exhale. <laughs> exhale. <laughs> exhale. 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 Yeah. Well, anyway, uh, it was so fun today. We're so okay. happy that we got to do this uh, with you guys. We're going to put um, her link yeah. under our video. And I will also attach like this video we're doing um, above Yeah. in the exclamation mark. It will pop out on YouTube. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah. go ahead, check, check her stuff out. It's yeah. really, really nice. Try yeah. it out. It's beginner yoga. It's not intense yoga. So anybody from different levels can do her, most of her videos. They're really user-friendly, um, people-friendly, bone-friendly. Bone-friendly. <laughs> <laughs> bone <-friendly. laughs> yeah. oh. Oops. Oh. Yeah. oh, there's That's our time. time. <laughs> we're, we're trying to do it in time. So... Um, give us some th thumbs up if yes. you like our video and like, subscribe, yep. follow us. Follow us on Instagram. We're gonna be posting a little <laughs> bit about self love and yep. what self love means and little exercises that you can do to love yourself on a deeper level. So check it out and we love you. Yeah, we love you and see you in our next video. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs>